Buckingham Palace says Lady Susan Hussey has met charity boss Ngozi Falani and apologised for racist comments made at a palace reception last month. Well, let's go live now to the newsroom and to our royal correspondent, Laura Bundock. Laura, how did the meeting go? What was said? We know that the meeting took place a little earlier on today. The pair met and we are told that the meeting was filled with warmth and understanding. During the meeting, we're told Lady Susan offered her sincere apologies for the comments that she had made and the, the distress that they had caused to Miss Falani. You may remember it was at a reception last month at Buckingham Palace when uh, Lady Susan Hussey, who was very, very close to the Queen, had been one of her ladies in waiting for many, many years, repeatedly asked, um, where are you from? Where are you from? Um, and it was those comments that caused her to have to step down from this honorary role. It sparked the palace to have to respond quickly to allegations of institutional racism. Anyway, the pair, as I say, have met today. Um, we also understand that Ms. Falani has accepted the apology and appreciates that no malice was intended. And here's a note also from Buckingham Palace that the royal households, they say, are going to continue their focus on inclusion and diversity with an enhanced programme of work which will extend knowledge and training programmes, examining what can be learnt from Sister Space, which is one of the organisations that we know Ngozi Falani works very closely with. We also understand that the King and Queen Consort have been kept informed and are said to be pleased that the parties have reached, reached what they describe as a welcome outcome. So news today, just in that earlier on today, uh, Lady Susan Hussey met and apologised uh, to Ngozi Falani after those racist remarks were made at Buckingham Palace last month.